Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to show you how you can turn your old Windows 10 PC into a NAS. First, you're going to go to the start menu, you're going to click settings. You're going to click network and internet, network and sharing center, advanced sharing settings. Make sure to turn on network discovery is on, save changes, close out of that. Now, you're going to go to your drive that you want to use as your NAS. Go to this PC, click on your drive. In this case, I'm going to be using my two terabyte hard drive. Click on the hard drive. As you can see, I already have a folder here named NAS. In the drive, create a new folder. Now I have a folder that says NAS1. Now you're going to go to properties, sharing, share, click the drop down, click everyone, share, done. Now this folder is now shared. Also, in order for this to work properly, you need to go into the folder that you want to turn into your NAS. You need to click properties, sharing, advanced sharing, permissions, and make sure full control change and read is selected. Also on your Windows PC, you need to make sure you get the name of your computer and write it down. To get the name, you need to go to click start, settings, system, about, and the name of your computer will be listed right here device name that's what you so the first thing we're going to do on the mac is open finder go in the menu bar click go and click connect to server now here is where having the device name from your windows pc is going to come into play as you can see what you need to do is type in smb colon slash slash then type in whatever your device name is on your pc in my case it is desktop dash fv8qr20 once you type in your device name on the Mac, it's going to prompt you to enter the username and password from your PC. Once you enter that, you're going to click connect. And as you can see, here we have the new file I just created. You're going to click OK. Now, whatever information you want to take from your Mac and transfer it to the hard drive in your old PC, all you need to do is create a new folder. In this case, I am gonna leave it as untitled folder. Now, let me just take a screenshot real fast. As you can see, I took the screenshot, done. Now the screenshot is on my desktop. We're gonna drag it into the NAS1 folder. Now it's in the untitled folder. Now, as you can see, we're back on the Windows PC. Now I'm gonna show you that the screenshot that we just took on the Mac is in this new folder I just created. See, we have the untitled folder, which we created on the Mac. Screenshot, here it is, right there. Now that is stored on the Windows PC hard drive instead of your MacBook's SSD. Also, once you copy the files from your Mac, to your NAS. In this case, you can see this screenshot is still here that I showed you previously that I transferred over to the NAS. Once it's transferred over to the Windows 10 PC, you can simply just erase it from the Mac and it will still be there on the NAS. Also, what you wanna do is set up so that it connects whenever your Mac starts up. To do that, you go to System Preferences you type in the search bar, login items, and as you can see here, I have the shared drive from the PC as one of my login items. To do that, all you have to do is click the lock, put in your password, click the plus, then you would wanna click the name of your computer, and then click D. Hit add. There you go. Now, click the lock again to prevent changes. Now, whenever you start up your Mac, it will automatically connect to the drive on your Windows PC. That's how you create a NAS using your old Windows PC.